up until about a year ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever, Brooklyn. Represent, had two cool parents, and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed though, when my dad was killed in the city hall bombing. I, I couldn't believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me. And I started to change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially Spider Bros. He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds. That is so cool. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The kid? Yeah, maybe. Original's just... My guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case. Sore, but it's secure. As long as the octopus related flaws have been fixed. Let's hope. Okay, closing in on you. Be there soon. Should let mom know I'll be late. 
Miles, ¿qué tal? Did you get the shopping list? Hey, mom. Uh, yeah, but uh, the bodega was out of coconut milk. I'm gonna check a store downtown. Oh, thank you. But avoid Midtown. That prison convoy is making traffic a nightmare. Oh yeah. Good call. See you at dinner, mom. Man, how does Pete do this secret identity thing? Completely stresses me out. Okay, be cool. Be cool. Helping Spider-Man protect the giant prison convoy? You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. Pete! You here? Just down in some rocket fuel. How are you... drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 en route, heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2, we've got you on scope. This is... a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances. Especially not with our guest of honor. <laughs> Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Doc is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion. Could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take. I got this beat. Don't worry. Huh? No. <laughs> it's secure. It's okay, we got this. Just need to contain it before... Before that happens. Hello, tiny spiders. Let's move! Hurry up! We gotta get out of here! Help me back here! Miles! I'm gonna need a hand! 
both one for minimizing destruction. The long bugle headline's gonna be a doozy. Worst thing out of this is a bad headline. I'ma count as lucky. Oh crap, crap, the winter bad! Hey, this is starting to feel real bad, man. Don't think like that. We're going to stop him as long as we work together. Speaking of, mind giving me a hand up here? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Okay, Pete. Yeah, I got this. Take it away, Capo. He's a weak minded! Oh! Hey, Jonah! Let me die! Very fast! Menace! A feckless, treacherous, unhinged menace! Get uh, right here! Yeah. Right here. Mi ¿dónde está? It's getting late. Hey, Mom! Yeah, coconut milk. Still trying to find it. Been kind of uh, an adventure. Are you funny? Yeah, uh, sorry. I'm trying to catch a train. Mira, mijo. No seas mentiroso. Grab the milk and hurry home, please. Dima, te quiero mucho. Yo también te quiero. Now we're never miles. We gotta stop him. On my way. Let us raise temperature. Oh, bad, bad, very bad. Pete, are you okay? No. No, no, no! I'm okay. I've got him. Headed your way. Be ready. Okay. Yeah. Might, uh, need a minute. Show me what you got! First tip for the police! Maybe don't bring RPGs to the prison convoy next time! Maybe don't bring RPGs anywhere! Got him, Lexi! No, okay, that was pretty good! Man, I'm trying to help you! More guys up top!
guys? Wow, just... <laughs> wow! Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry. I think our ball landed in your yard. No. Actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But, uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you. Both of you. Taking down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until mm, something like this happens. Oh, Judy calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Just... Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest, a little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh, man. Yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you, I'm not gonna be around for the next few weeks. Is this some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup. And you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath a real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up. The city late at night hit a pinnacle. Shining on my brother. But those on the game They know the true form of pure evil is invisible So I keep a lot of vision Every night I try to read your mind I see you see your eyes Don't let me catch your eye I won't waste your time to solve I don't know what's in the soul My palms open Yankee, dude, Rhino, what? <laughs> yeah, where you at? You get into the apartment, okay? Yeah, your mom let me in. Unpacked slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park, grabbing some air. Oh, perfect. Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Pics I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts. Ha, <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. 
Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there. Let's go. Maybe yeah, we can go up. Feeling just don't stop in that. Try to hate all of us. Yankee's probably waiting at the amphitheater for me. It's just one more weekend. I'm really speaking. I'm talking about the talk. I will never get used to you doing that. Hey, look, check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. <laughs> Dude, put it on. I'll cover you. Oh. What? <laughs> never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Head up town for part two of this amazing gift. This is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just the Facts with me, your truth-slinging host with the most, Gay Jonah Jameson. What? This Pete said his suits the autoplay Jameson show? Guy's a masochist. Sad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to fast vigilante mayhem. got to be something better on. Uh, been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Dana Picard, and this is the Dancast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our world. Today's topic? Well, you know, stockbrokers, profit colleges, the people who make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> No, obviously we're covering the Spider-Men's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, DanaCast, new favorite podcast. This is the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your terms is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite, the swing kick. This 
Holotech is next gen. With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Parker. Now let's combine these two moves. Attacking <laughs> airborne enemies is a great method of crowd control. Plus, the sounds they make are hilarious. <laughs> Splam! Classic. Initiate melee attack. high-tech gear we can sell. Uh, oh, crap. Spider-Man! Uh, take them out! Then grab the gear! You all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay, let's go. Take the spider out and grab the tech gear. Yeah. Gonna make bank selling this stuff off. Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech. Y'all are not authorized to resell. Fix a training sim. Critical fault on circuit AF fifteen. Colonel panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice, that did it. it. Looks like Pete made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah. I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge. Or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. How about venom power? You know, because it stings. <laughs> 
Okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom power. Trust me, it's gold. telling people about this podcast. We've jumped the charts from 136 to 87. Like, uh, wow. <laughs> okay, okay, moving. Today I'm doing a quick task before I head downtown for my citizenship test, and I'm answering fan DMs. First one, where are you from, Danica? Well, I was born in Fuzhou, China, but we came to New York when I was six. Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvorm. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Hmm. No sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. They did a search for new food. What were they gonna do with it? Uh-huh. You were right. It's a break-in. Sounds like they're after 
new form. New form? The stuff in the reactor? It's not installed yet. You're talking about shipments. Weird. Super weird. Hey, I did that grocery shopping your mom wanted, but she's wondering where you are. Dinner's almost ready. Crap. Okay. I'll try to wrap this up. Thanks, man. They're moving the new form. Talking about new form shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments, but why? <laughs> Rocks on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. I gotta get home. Christmas dinner sounding pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group and the new form shipments tomorrow. <laughs> 